One horse? Ground pounder. Thank you kindly, Overload, for paying your debt. Those zebras you got for me have been doing a fine job of picking apples on the farm. Slow to start, but quickly got the message after some hobbling and a good whipping. Weed whacker. <laughs> Throw myself off the cliff was over dramatic, and you deserve a reward for helping with Nightmare Coon, even if it's illegal for Earth ponies to own property. Cousin Copulator! Come on, Spike. You need to make more of an effort with those old and overplayed insults. No way! If I put more effort in, it'd be too hard for him to understand. <laughs> yeah, that's a pretty good one, I suppose. Plant Busher. Lauren Bumbler. Crop Cunt! Yes, Spike. That was a good one. <laughs> Crock hunt! Whatever! It's a letter from Princess Sunny Buns! <clears throat> Attention, artists! The regal Sunny D appreciates the efforts of Twilight Sparkle and a bunch of other ponies who were there as well, I guess, for the defeat of Nightmare Coon and your recent success in touching grass. Uh, yada yada yada. Hereby awards the prize of a box of tendies plus two dollars. <gasps> tendies and real money! money. The freshness surprises you, the hatred of envy The force of the wrathful yet autism binds us together for all of eternity Real currency? Excellent. We'll be out of our currency shortage in no time. Isn't that great, Spike? Nah, I'm not really into that inflation stuff. But if you're into it, then you do you. Huh, oh, come on. Stop being such a hawk. Yeah. Paper money might be the best thing since sliced bread. Think of all the things we could buy. When I ran that apple stand last gala, I was happy to take bits, you know, on account of it being money. But do you realize how hard it was to lug that chest of solid gold coins everywhere? It wasn't good for my teeth, either. Plus, since it's paper money, the government can print as much of it as we need. We could fix housing and infrastructure. Wow! Buy better equipment for our slave laborers. Nice! And best of all, free health care for every pony. Wow! Day metal currency is abolished. Well, in that case, I've got a meeting on Jekyll Island. You may be inter. Are we talking about cold, hard cash? Rainbow Dash. Didn't I tell you to leave after I caught you with Apple Bloom? What were you doing? Spying? Nope. I live here now. I am homeless. And I so happen to hear you have a dollar? Yeah, but. Yes! This is so awesome! Don't you realize how many things I could do with paper money? I could be anything. I can see it now. minute here. I thought I told you to get lost. It's a free country, dumbass! Oh yeah? Well I challenge you to a dead battle! Winner gets the money. You. Whatever. 
Jennifer, let's get back on track. What do you want the money for? Getting more slaves for the farm. Pizza and tacos at the same time. Money to buy a new whip. Pizza and tacos. Fucking hell, girls. Neither of you really thought this through, did you? <laughs> Listen to that. I am starving. I don't know about you, but I can't think straight without a belly full of hay burgers. So I'll uh, think about it over lunch and get back to you two, okay? Okay. <laughs> So who are you gonna give the extra dollar to, Twilight? Nigger, I don't fucking know. They're all being a bunch of needy little bitches and none of them deserve it. Now where's the Wendy's? Joys of cold hard cash money, all the things it could buy for the most raunchy party. Hip hip, hooray! All the cold hard cash money for Pinky, with decorations like dildos and anal beads and latex and vibrators and marachitis, with goodies like crab cubes and death sticks and sundays and sunbeams and alcohol, and I get to explore all my deepest of deepest fetishes like BDSM and needle play. All the wonders and joys of cold hard cash money, all the things it could buy for the most raunchy party. Hip hip, hooray! All the cold hard cash money for Pinky. Whee! Oh, thank you, Twilight. It's the most wonderful gift ever. Um, shut up, you pink spaz. <gasps> are these what I think they are? Uh, yes. Real money? I spend years designing raunchy outfits, showcasing them at your ponyville orgies. Oh, the dresses, the saddles, the bridles. All of this for free, mind you. But with real money, I could meet him. Him! Who? Him. After years of getting paid only in sore flanks and used condoms, I've never earned any real money. The unicorn slave owners have hoarded all the wealth for generations, and I've never been able to break into the market. But if I had real money, I could finally afford to buy enough gamer fuel to attract the attention of the highest levels of royalty, convincing Princess Sunny Buns to introduce me to the hunkiest stud in all the land. Anonymous! He's the ultimate gamer, connoisseur of anime, stunningly overweight and boldly artistic! His collection of fedoras makes him the prime example of a perfect gentleman. And he'd treat me with the respect I deserve. And of course, I'd happily oblige him. He'd rise from his basement and make me his waifu. Which is <laughs> what I would become upon marrying him. The stallion of my dreams. Twilight, I simply cannot believe you would invite Pinkie Pie so she can fornicate. And prevent me from meeting my true love. How could you? <laughs> what? Get back here! Eh? Huh? Two American shekels. Argado Bunnykin. Well, to tell the truth, both of your ideas are equally trashed, so... You don't to choose me! Sumi Masen, Purple Smart. If I can suggest, like, to be honest, those sluts don't deserve them. I say! What the devil did you just audaciously proclaim about my well-being? Um, I shall inform you mind. that I have graduated top of my class at the gentle mayor's sophisticated Actually, presence and have been involved in numerous me endeavors with the lovely deserve those shekels. I, 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 I don't really care about the quality. I just want to spend it all on the cooler content. All of the erotic pony donates, bots, and hulu sees. I will be so horny I could even flop into bark bags. And that just the paywall scrubs? Don't get me started on our packs. There's latex and crossovers and mirrors with flares. Fanfics that make me flick my beam. And the Dragon Souls powered sex toys. And chat circle jerk with feedbacks, spammers, traps, and the chat hole tarts. How are you gonna do nothing wrong? That sounds way fucking gayer than Dash on Pride Month. Wait just a minute. Rainbow Dash. Were you stalking me? No, I mean yes. I mean, maybe. Look, it doesn't matter. I can't risk 
you giving my taco and pizza money away to some pony else? Wait just another minute. Applejack, were you stalking me too? No, I was stalking this cunt to make sure she didn't try any funny business. Still trying to take my money. Your money? But that's for my cocaine. Oh, what, you 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 what have I done to deserve these packets in my life? Grounded in much. Oh. Um, does anyone else want to keep pushing me on this? But Tara. Shut your stupid whore mouth! I swear I'll bust a nigga! Try me, you sluts, and see what happens! Fuck, I want to for another filly. Just fuck off, you cunts! <laughs> and don't worry, I'll get this shit sorted! Assholes. Oh, man, what am I gonna do? All five of the other artists have really good reasons to want the dollars. Greed, or pride, envy, or lust, wrath. What do I do? Have you made your decision? I can't decide! Twilight, this is a Wendy's, you spurg. Oh, I guess I'll just have a big old plate of spaghetti. Do you offer happy endings? No. Okay, I'll have the nuggies. Extra dipping sauce. What do you think, Spike? I think you should just keep the gala tickets to yourself. I mean, your friends are fine, but wouldn't it be funnier if you just told them all the fuck off? I mean, about the cash money and who I should give it to. <sighs> We're still doing that. Spike, listen! How do I decide? And when I do choose, will the other faggots try to dox me? I mean, I could just duplicate the money with magic, but they'll go to jail as soon as it's discovered to be counterfeit. What if I... Ah, your food. Oh, finally. Maybe I'll go into a food coma and not have to make a decision on this shitty problem. Madame, are you going to eat your food in the rain? It's not raining. Fucking feather brains! My best unicorn friend that I super love, platonically, enjoying the sunbeams? What the fuck are you doing, you clit-sucking faggot? What do you mean? I just saw the most based and least autistic pony I know about to get spooked on. So I thought I'd buck a hole in the cloud so she could munch in peace. That's all. Rainbow, are you seriously such a cunt that you'd set up an entire rainstorm just so you could pretend to save me from it so I give you the extra dollar? Me? No, 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 of course not. Uh-huh. Seriously, it was totally pre-scheduled. <laughs> Rainbow, I am not comfortable with your gay-ass bullshit. So I'd appreciate it if you'd fuck off and let me eat in peace. Ugh. Fine. That's better. <sighs> Twilight, you're soaked. Keen eye, Captain Obvious. Come with me before you make unicorns look bad. Oh, shit. My bad. Oh, no. It's fine, dear. Accidents happen. It's no big deal. You've been absolutely tortured today, haven't you? You know what tortured souls deserve? Uh... Sweet release! <laughs> I understand, Spike, but I can't have any witnesses. It was just a dream? As if I'd get murdered for no reason. That's ridiculous. Don't dream. Oh, Spike went home a little while ago. <laughs> He's a bit of a fuckwad anyway. This is all about fashion and how cash money you look if you buy that dress for a dollar. Wait, a dollar? <gasps> and oh my goodness, what a coincidence. I happen to have an equally alluring piece. The gold with yours perfectly. We will be the balls of the bell. You and I, the stallions, would be fighting for our attention. All eyes would be on us. 
and then everyone would finally know that the most sophisticated, most rugged, most pungent stallion in all of Equestria belongs to Rarity the Unicorn. <laughs> but you could borrow him on weekends, of course. I see through your bullshit. You're just being nice, so I'll give you the extra dollar. Well, you can take your fake favor and shove it in the same place you probably dream of Anon's cock going. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've been trying all day just to get anything to eat. Did some pony say bore? What? Fuck! What the hell? I've got apple pie. Nugget apples. We got apples, apple cake. Oh, it's so it's so so okay. Okay. I'd like to apologize. Yeah? There weren't a filly to sacrifice in such a short notice. Would you accept these, best overlord friend? Just for a dollar. Twilight? No, fuck no! What the hell is up with all of you? None of you faggots haven't given me a bit of peace to decide. Besides, I was being sarcastic earlier! <laughs> sarcastic of what? Fuck me! Of all the things to happen to me today! <sighs> Can this day get any worse? Cleaning the crime scene, cleaning the crime scene, hide the body, tell no one. <gasps> Fluttershy, you're a murderer. Oh, oh, hi, oh, Twycoon. Um, this isn't blood. We accidentally spilled red ink all over. Where's Spike? Oh, well, maybe he went to Rarity's to, um, toss her salad. Fluttershy, you didn't actually kill him, did you? Oh, no, I'm just a crewmate. White is sus. Boat Angel. Oh, yes, I brutally murdered Spike. Sacrifice them. No, no, no! Great, thanks to you. Now I have to sacrifice a virgin Pegasus just to get his soul back from the depths of hell. So leave now before I choose you. Surprise! Twilight is my richest friend, Woofy. Woofy, cute as hot as all around best pony. Oh, oh, that if I throw a super duper hot or G or E, what? She'll give her extra special paper money to me. <laughs> yes, Twilight? I do not need an orgy. What are you, a pimp? You can't have my money. Wait, what money? Paper currency? Oh, you didn't know? I was arranging for us to all have sex with Twilight in exchange for her new fangled paper currency. Paper currency? Have I told you how much I like your maid? I lick your hooves. I drink your maid. I have a bunch of carrots we can use. I'll lick your cookies. Bob, what are we gonna do? Come on, faggot. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Hey Twilight, did you just see the original Yakety Sax? This is a bad video. We don't give a flying fuck about copyright. Why did you have to spurg out again for no reason? Again. That was way too much time outside for one day. We need to hide now! I beg all of you, fuck off! You spend all day stalking me for your selfish, unimportant needs and pretending to be nice just because I am basically rich now. Even if I gave away all my money, three of you would still be mad at me. I can't even decide which is worse. Well, that sugar, I, I didn't mean to put so much pressure on you. And being honest, I don't need those dollars anymore. After all, my new workers are paid the same as internet janitors. Me too. To think I did this for content that's on Kimono Hardy anyways. Emmy 3 it's no fun upsetting your friends. Twilight, I'm sorry for treating you like an earth pony. Yes! That means tacos and pizzas for me! <laughs> I knew it! Being a cut always works! You know, as the best pony, I should probably maintain a healthier diet than just fast food. I don't need that dollar either. 
We were so caught up chasing paper money that in the meantime inflation took away nine-tenths of its value. We're sorry, Twilight. Spike, take down a note. Dear Princess Celestia, this idea of storing value on paper is just plain stupid. While I absolutely love the ability to wiggle my wealth to everyone's face, it's not funny when you can't buy anything with it. So, though I appreciate the gesture, you can't have your paper back. I keep my rape money. What? If I can't buy sweet horse pussy, this paper's worthless. Oh, my own Celestia. I was to poor forever. Well, you choose to be a farmer. Too bad. Spike, send it. <gasps> to your dreams of running a quest. Don't be silly, girls. Why, I'm a pure blood unicorn. I still want to kill the monarchy. <laughs> you story tards are everything. <laughs> well clamp my clitoris, Spike. Ain't that just like a foam? Can't handle the least bit of poison. Whoa, shit. A letter from the Overlord? That was fast. My faithful student, Twilight. Twilight, you're retarded, Spurg. Do you think money's an issue for me? Six of paper money, cash, dollar, dollars! <gasps> now we have money for all of us! Oh, yeah! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Perhaps we should spend it on dinner. My vote is still on pizza and tacos! I hope you mean the food, Dash. I don't. Why well, y'all gotta make it clear? How come I don't get any money to spend? And one for you, Spike. <laughs> I mean, gross! I have to use paper money, too. <laughs> <laughs>